On top of some breaking news this morning in Rancho Bernardo, a couple there says they were forced to run for their lives after three people invaded their house. Sandy's News reporter Kristen Keo is live there in that neighborhood. What a scary night for this family, Kristen. Yeah, this is terrifying. The guys came in with headlamps on and totally disoriented this couple at about 345 while they were asleep. They also had masks over their faces and they did have a gun. They got in through a side door in the garage and right now it's not clear if it was left unlocked or if they had to force their way in. We have video of that couple still walking around the neighborhood in their pajamas. Thank goodness they are okay this morning. The intruders tied them up during all of this with shoes strings. The men demanded cash and jewelry from them, so the couple gave them what they wanted and the guys took off. I asked police this morning if residents over in this area should be worried after the second home invasion within two, 10 miles in two weeks. It's always a good idea to be vigilant, to make sure your doors and windows are locked, to look out for each other as neighbors. So police are looking for three men. They left here on foot in dark clothing, and the couple told police they, they seem to be Hispanic, but again, it's so hard to tell with masks over their faces. So police are really depending on anyone who may have seen something to give them a call so they can track down these three people. Live in Rancho Bernardo this morning, I'm Kristen Keogh, 10 News. Thank